Welcome back everybody to another video on the Brembo channel better known as Travis Benjamin. So in this video what I have for you guys is the week 4 XP extravaganza challenges. So some people call them you know week 14 challenges but they're actually you know called week 4 XP extravaganza challenges. So I'm going to go over these early they are leaked early. Um, so for the first challenge we have um, damage with assault rifles so deal damage with assault rifles and for stage one you need 1000 damage stage two you need 2500 damage and stage three you need 5000 damage moving on to the second challenge you need to hit opponents with boogie bombs or shock wave grenades so I recommend using Team Rumble because you're going to get a lot more in that mode. So 20,000 XP for each stage. So for stage 1, you need to hit opponents with one boogie bomb or shockwave grenade. Then stage 2, hit opponents with five boogie bombs or shockwave grenades. And then moving on stage 3, hit opponents with 10 boogie bombs or shockwave grenades. Now remember, you have to complete the first stage before you can move on to the next stage, just like in the other weeks. Okay, so next challenge is going to be fish for items from a motorboat, helicopter, and a pickup truck bed. Okay, so here's how it works. Stage one, you fish for items from a motorboat. You just need to um, get, you know, one fish while you're you know in a motorboat so you you're in the back of a motorboat and then you're good to go stage two fish for items from a motorboat and a chopper in a single match so you're gonna need to use the motorboat and the chopper so you have to fish on the chopper wing and then also you know um, fish from one of the passenger seats in the boat Next, for stage three, you need to fish for items from a motorboat, a chopper, and a pickup truck bed in the single match. So, in a single match, you're going to be, you know, using a boat, a chopper, and also the truck. So, in the back of a truck, you can go, you know, out of the driver's seat into the back of the truck, and you just fish from there. Um, so that will be stage three. So you're gonna do each stage and then you go into the final stage Which um, I went over all three stages next Is a little bit of a different challenge which is maintain full health and shield So stage one you need to maintain full health and shield for two minutes in a single match then we have you know stage two which is maintain full shield and health for four minutes in a single match. And then the final stage is going to be maintain full health and full shield for eight minutes in a single match. So you want to make sure you, you know, it doesn't have to be that you have health immediately, but once you're in the game, you know, you have full health and your full shield and you continue to keep that for a period of you know two minutes for the first four for the second and then stage three will be eight full minutes okay moving on deliver a semi truck from outside upstate New York to Stark Industries so I'm going to show you guys here where I think you should go so uh, I haven't even completed the XP extravaganza week three challenges and I am already on level 370 so right here though, um, deliver a semi truck from outside upstate New York and then you're going to visit, um, basically take that to Stark Industries. So there is this truck right here on the map, right here where my, my mouse is at, right here on this bridge and you're going to take that all the way into Stark Industries and then you'll be good to go. So that completes, you only need to do that one time. Moving on to the uh, next um, uh, challenge, 
and uh, for that you're going to generate power for Stark Industries by riding zip lines to and from upstate New York. So if you look here on my mouse, there's up there, you know, the zip lines here. There's a zip line over this way that heads down this way. And you know, there's two zip lines right beside each other right here. So you can generate power somehow. This is, you know, obviously going to take place closer to the event. Um, and these challenges are leaked, so they're not out yet. You can't complete them yet. Right now, people are working on the week three challenges. These are the week four challenges. All right, so generate power for Stark Industries by riding zip lines to and from upstate New York. So I feel like you'll just have to, you know, kind of go down, up and down the zip lines, and you'll charge up power. Should not be too difficult. Now, the next challenge is harvest buses and RVs in native Fortnite locations. So I'll say that again, harvest buses and RVs. So RVs are like those little campers. So you need to harvest buses and RVs in native Fortnite locations. So in native locations, in my opinion, is going to be um, a named location is like this here, Lazy Lake, Misty Meadows, Retail Row. So somewhere, on the you know in a location that is not named would be like a native location so you need to harvest you know buses rvs um in a native fortnite locations so let me go back and see um here what we need to do is for the for um it looks like you only need to do that one time so it's not gonna be too tough then we have release um release slurp so next we have release so these are when the challenges get a little bit um a little bit weird because we're not able to actually know what they're going to to be yet or how to complete them but i'm going to still give them to you early anyways so release slurp into the atmosphere and you're going to be able to need to do that a number of times and then you have boogie before oblivion so you need a boogie before oblivion so i don't know if that means using the boogie down dance um we'll have to wait until it gets closer to that live event and then the final challenge is going to be eliminate opponents at Stark Industries, Misty Meadows, or Weeping Woods. And that's going to be 15 total opponents. So all together, you should get 360,000 XP um, for completing all of these challenges. And, you know, right now I still need to do my week three challenges. And then I'll work on these week four challenges when they are released. They will be released on, you know, not this Thursday, but next Thursday. So, you know, we just had these ones released. So the Thursday, you know, at 9 a.m. Eastern time, as they usually um, are released. And that will be the last set of XP extravaganza for this week. Um, I mean, for this season. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video, got some information. Um, the only ones, you know, that we're kind of not clear on is the release slurp into the atmosphere, boogie down, boogie before oblivion, you know, and then other than that, all the challenges are pretty clear. Um, the, you know, generate power for Stark Industries by riding the zip lines to and from upstate New York seems pretty easy. Um, and then harvest buses and RVs in native Fortnite locations um you know that one is a little bit unclear just because we're not sure exactly what native locations are but it should be you know any location that's not a named location so hopefully this video helped you guys out if it did drop a like feel free to subscribe to the channel and yeah um i'm looking forward to completing the week three challenges live on stream um for the xp extravaganza and then pushing on to the week five 
um, I mean the week four challenges. Um, so I'm putting, you know, I got the new caster skin on, and then we also have that Marvel Super Cup that's going on right now. So, anyways, if you guys did enjoy the video, drop a like, feel free to subscribe, and I'll catch you guys on the next one. This is Brembo, and I'm out. GG's.